The children aged between 7 to 15 have been surviving from hand to mouth as their aunt, 29-year-old Kandali Nafuka, who took over the responsibility to care for them, is unemployed. In addition, Nafuka has her own three children. Following the broadcast of their plight on NBC News, Ondangwa-based Earth Logic pledged a $2,000 monthly voucher for food and other needs for the next five years. We from the Earth Logic, uh, we really feel bad when you hear that story on news. And me and my CEO, Shabal Anyama, we decide to help these families with the little we have. That's why we come up with a, a voucher of food for them. 2000 per month for five years, continuously or renewable. The authority or the councillor, if they can allocate this family with a plot or with a land, affordable one, so that we can uh, build for them something to call a home, for them to stay. Like we understand that the way they are currently staying now, it's not belong to them, it's, it's, they, they're just given by one Samaritan. That's why you want to help them. He also pledged to build a home for the family if they get a plot for the children to have a better foundation and concentrate on their education. A window-based family of Palas Nepembe also donated full uniform kits and school bags to seven orphans and one of their caretaker's children. He urged Namibians who are able to assist the needy to do so find out that uh, there's people who need help. Uh, that's why we came up with uh, this family of mine to donate also the, the uniform as you can see it here. Ndapanda Shuya, NBC News, Oshikango location.